Hi, this is Kevin for Consumer Search Reviews. <clears throat> and today we're going to be uh, discussing Amazon Prime. I'm going to focus on the Prime Music and uh, show you how to create a playlist and, show, and, and uh, play it on your uh, smartphone. So let me give you a quick example of that. Get my smartphone turned on here. Now, when you get the phone turned on, uh, just look for, you have to download the Amazon Music app. And you just tap on the little orange Amazon logo. And then, once you create your playlist, it'll show up on your Amazon uh, application here. So you can see I created several playlists. 1950s, 60s, ballads, country, gospel, mix. So I'll just tap on the last one there. And uh, you can see there's a lot of uh, songs on there. You can switch them up the way you want. Here, I'll go ahead and play one. So you get the gist of it. Once you create your playlist, you can play them on your computer, you can play them on your uh, phone, and uh, so forth. So let me get started here. And first of all, just so you are aware of it, in case you're not even familiar with Amazon Prime, you get videos. So when you uh, become a member, you have access to a lot of great TV shows, a lot of great movies. Amazon Prime stream over a million songs with Prime Music and you can get a 30-day free trial sounds good and you get everything with it you get the music you get the free shipping and so forth now uh, once you get your playlist created you can pay, uh, play them or listen to them on your phone your tablet your computer and your Fire TV if you have Amazon Fire TV which is uh, like a Roku player for Amazon Prime uh, you can play your music on your TV set as well so you have a lot of great options so let's go ahead and explore Prime Music alright now once you get on uh, Prime Music you're just going to play around a little bit you can see there's a lot of uh, artists that uh, you may be familiar with and uh, you can go ahead and check all that out. I would suggest going to the popular artist option right here. Now when you get on that one, you can see that uh, you have unlimited options for your artist. First thing you have to do is choose some songs. So I'm just going to click on one of these albums. This is Elvis Presley. And uh, let's see, we're going to add some music to the library here. So let's go ahead, let's see here. All shook up. Okay, we're going to go ahead and add that to the library. All right. And let's see what else. Return to sender. Add in the library. And what else? Wonder of You. Add that to the library. All right, now when you get up to the top of the page, you can see here where it says your music library. You're just going to click on that. Okay, now you're on the uh, playlist. Now I happen to be, uh, it's automatically going to one of my playlists. Uh, what you want to do is create a playlist. Because you can't add a song to a list unless you have one. So we're going to, first of all, we're just going to go here and create a new playlist. 
enter your playlist name. Okay, new. Playlist. We're gonna save that. All right, so now we're gonna go up here to recently added to the library. Remember those three songs I just added to the library? The Wonder of You, remember that one? Add to playlist. My new playlist is added. And here's re Return to Sender, Add to Playlist, New Playlist. All shook up, Add to Playlist, New Playlist. And go ahead, add one more Burning Love, New Playlist. All right, now. To show you the playlist, we're just going to go over here, your playlist, and there's our new one, the new playlist we just created. And here you are, here's uh, the playlist. But now you have your playlist, and you can play this, you can add to it, you can, you can delete it, you can do anything you want. Uh, now, one other thing, I found that uh, over the, the past year or so that I've had Amazon Prime on my phone, uh, sometimes you get tired of hearing the same songs in the same order. So what you can do is to go ahead and click on a song and move it down to a different location. Now it's there. So and when you get to a song... Uh, you can do a lot. You can go ahead and remove it from the playlist if you get tired of it entirely, uh, or you can just go ahead and rearrange it. But you get the gist of it. So I think uh, that tells you exactly how this all works. You can add songs, delete songs, rearrange songs, uh, and you can play them on your phone just like you would a, a uh, an iPod, I guess. All right, guys, that's basically it. I think you get the gist of it. And uh, if you already have Amazon Prime and not taking advantage of this, uh, you're missing the boat. You have over a million songs av available to you. They're constantly adding new songs. Uh, oh, by the way, just in, I think I did forget one thing. Once you get your play playlist recorded, of course, in order to play it, you have to stream it. Uh, you can also download to your phone the song. So once you get your playlist recorded and you're pretty happy with it, uh, you can go ahead and just download it to your phone and then you don't have to stream it anymore. You won't have to worry about connections and so forth. It'll be right on your phone and you'll have unlimited access to it with no interruptions. So this is Kevin for Consumer Search Reviews and I hope this has been informative for you and I hope you have a great day and enjoy your prime music. This is Kevin for Consumer Search Reviews. Have a great day. Bye-bye.